Congratulations, Amy. Well played. Now that's gonna look like a dominant game on TV, of course, but you all spent a long time hunting for that daily double. If you had found Doc Holliday, it would have been tight going into final. Love Tombstone. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't sure about Limestone, but then I realized if I didn't ring in, he was definitely going to get the daily double, so it was worth trying. And yeah. I got it, yeah. That is smart strategy there. I was kind of, I was wondering, Tyler, guess a rock, guess a rock. Yeah. Probably, you know, coulda, woulda, shoulda, but you know, hopefully I got your heart rate elevated a little bit at some you, point, you did, so. You did, yeah. It's good play. Cormac McCarthy, of course, you both knew, so it didn't affect the outcome. Um, explain the wager, 64, is that a lucky number? Uh, that is uh, my wife's birthday. Well, that's a nice little salute because you could have wagered any amount there. Maybe that's not the message to send. As long as it doesn't <laughs> matter which number I use at all. Well, I mean, I'll yeah, birthday. I, I never bet a non-round amount in, in my original run because like I already find the math stressful enough and I didn't like it just seemed too complicated but you know I had the chance here and the money isn't real so yeah. Well congratulations to all three of you for making it to the semifinals. Will you two be rooting for Amy the the champion you played or do you want to see uh, someone else take her down? Of course. Yeah. <laughs> Ask right in front yes. of me. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is the no go pressure. 2.0 over here like who else are we cheering for not Amy? Well said. Hey Ken, what's that thing the kids say? You mean smash the like, subscribe, and bell button so you'll be the first to know when we upload more great videos? Yeah, that's it. Do that.